This is yours, is it? Yeah, yeah, it's all yours. These are cool. He's a hoarder of uh, collectible toys. Man. Yes. Did you get them in a bulk lot, did you? Yeah, two for five. That's how being signed. How much? How much for all of them? Yeah, about the tenth person. That's the way to do it, though. You know, that's no, the way to do it. Do you, you don't want to do them as a? Well, I just want to make sure. You profit on them. Say seventy. Seventy. I was smart. I use them. I could do that. Well, you have to listen up all yeah, individually. <laughs> that's all right. So I ended up grabbing all of those wrestling action figures for seventy bucks, but at two dollars each, I'm not too sure. I'm not sure exactly what any of them are worth. I'm just going to get back home and do some comp research, which I'm going to do in this video today. I'm going to show you if there were any good ones in the mix. Fingers crossed there is. Um, but at 70 bucks, I think I should be safe on the purchase. Let me know in the comments uh, if you would have done that. Yeah, would you do... Would you do 30, like 15 and 15? You're okay, I will Okay. So this was a really good buy. I've got the Brooks Glycerin 19s in like new condition that sells for about $90. And these are the Nike Hyperdunks that sell for a similar price. So to get them for $30 is awesome. But what happens next was, well, surprising. $40. Why I need $10 to get to you. Thanks. We need to find who I can Yeah, no worries. You look up my shop. I yeah, you. yeah, can do. I'll sell for you. Yeah. We've got really good prices, guys. How are you, mate? How's how things? Much things? The horse? Uh, the how much are you willing to pay? Five bucks. Five bucks? How about 20? How about 10 bucks, that's it. Mm, no, nah, I'd have to pass. All right, me too. Thank you, though. Thanks, how you going, sir? You're usually buying, though, aren't you? Hey, you usually I am usually buying. I'm mining a stall for someone. Uh, I'm going to try and sell some stuff for her. Good morning. Ah, nice, aren't they? $15. Yeah. I need money. You got it? Yeah, they got it. Um, somebody offered me ten, uh, $5 or $10 for that frame. Uh, fam, where are they? Photo frame. Where are they now? Why you don't grab them and touch money for me? I said, I said $20. Okay. Okay. I said twenty dollars. Yeah, me though. I want Is that what you? Yeah, you want twenty? Yeah. Oh, good. I wasn't sure. All right, you've got it from here. Thank you. Thank you. These are pretty cool, hey? What do you reckon? How much would you pay for that? No. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. It's a four. Is it a four? Oh, yeah. That's a good point. What about the Ferrari though? Oh, that's a good one. You get the Ferrari. Yeah. <coughs> How about that? $55 though. I don't know about that. The 007, is that Bluetooth or DVD? No, ordinary DVD. Whatever's it's DVD, that, is it? Yeah, whatever's in that button there, mate. This one here? No, no, not that one. No, he's talking about this I'm one. I'm talking about this. Oh, you're talking about that, eh? How much? 25. 25. The lowest would be 20. Yeah, I might pass on that though. This one was a tough one to look back on because this 007 James Bond collection actually sells for about $90 on eBay and I pass it up here at the flea for 25 bucks. So there's a real lesson learned here. Make sure you do your comp research and don't always go off your best judgment. But thank you, mate. I've got this one too. The back to back. Yeah, that's that's pretty sweet. Um, no, that'll sell. That'll be, that'll be good today. Only about 15 on that. <coughs> 15, yeah. Well, the lowest will be 10. 10, yeah, okay. No, no stress. I appreciate it, guys. Matty, do you know how many subs he's on? A thousand? No. Oh. Close. How many? Nine. Nine thirty-six. Nine thirty-six. Go, bro. So the goal today in this video is to get, get Jack. Sixty-four more. We need sixty-four subs for Oz Jeez. Treasure Hunters. Yep. To hit a like thousand on YouTube. Straight in there. And if you're already a subscriber, why don't you hit a comment and a like for the boy? Right? <laughs> Get him to a thousand. You want a big giveaway at a thousand as well. A big, big giveaway. Big Huge. giveaway. It'll be big. What are you giving away? Uh, so I gotta, I gotta find it first. Oh, you don't have it yet, <laughs> but it's gonna It'll be, be a big. big one. It'll be a big one, yeah. <laughs> I reckon you get a thousand subs if you gave away a Game Boy. Look, if Pokemon. this does get a thousand from your video, then I'll give away one of my uh, wow. my Game Boys. Wow, wow, wow. Game Boy. that's a cool giveaway. That's a big one. All right, like, subscribe. Only if we get a thousand though yeah, off this video. Yep. Go and subscribe. Yeah. Go and subscribe to yeah. Oz Treasure Hunters. So these things are called fingerlings, and this one is the Untamed Dire Wolf. And it goes for about twenty to twenty-five dollars, which is pretty cool. You wouldn't have thought it, but it actually works as well. He turns on, 
moves, his eyes move. But it's just not something I sell, so. I'm gonna put him back. This is another category that I don't know a heap about. I don't know exactly what I'm looking for with the vinyl records for top dollar. So it'd be really interesting to get your thoughts in the comments below. So I've checked every single stall. I'm pretty comfortable with what I've been able to come away with here, but I'm really curious as to what these action figures actually comp out to. I'm gonna go back home and I'm gonna look into it. I'm gonna research every single one and I'm gonna bring you the total value a little bit later in this video. So stick around for it. I'm very curious to see how much this $70 purchase is actually gonna return me. So this has been really interesting to go over this category because as I've touched on in this video, it's not something that I've really done too much before. I haven't been able to source too many of these toys yet. I do know that some of them can go for some pretty good money. I've just spent the last hour having a look on eBay to see how much these are worth, but also what I should be actually looking for for the most amount of money in the category. And I've got some interesting information for you. Firstly, this allocation, there are 31 action figures here and they all range in price. I'll put some comps up on the screen for you here. Some of them go for $20 to $30 each, but on average, they're all about $10 to $15 plus postage. So I can comfortably say that there's about $300 worth of action figures right here. So pretty good considering I bought it for 70 bucks. Uh, my favorite was Jeff Hardy. He was absolutely my favorite growing up when I was watching him on Fox 8. And there's a bunch of other really cool characters in here as well. What you should be looking for, or what I wish was this allocation, was the Mattel Elite Series. If you find the Mattel Elite Series, and a good way to sort of work out which ones they are when you're outsourcing, if they've got a midsection break, that's generally a Mattel. This, this one isn't, unfortunately this is the Jax Pacific. Um, and the Jack Pacific are all of these. Uh, 2003 pretty much is, is the year. Um, but if you can find the Mattel Elite series, they go between $40 to $60. And that's a good telltale sign, that mid-break in the body. So um, yeah, hopefully you can find a few of those because they all range for some pretty wild money. But um, obviously they're a lot tougher to find than these guys. But I'm happy with the purchase. $70 into maybe $170 is what I'm thinking. I don't think I'm gonna list them individually. I think I'm gonna do a big bulk lot for 31 of them and uh, we'll go 170 bucks, which would net me a double your money scenario, which I, I think is a pretty good buy. Uh, let me know if you would've gone ahead with the purchase uh, in the comments below. Uh, I think it's a pretty cool item and I think I'm gonna look for those Mattel Elites uh, next time that I'm out. It's all about learning in this game, guys. Um, speaking of learning, there's a huge flea market video right here, which goes through some items that really sell on eBay quickly. This was an awesome haul. So go and check that video out. Appreciate you being here, guys. We'll see you soon.